The Kansas Board of Regents says college enrollment is down in Kansas. K-State saw their drop by more than 4% this year. And KSNT News reporter James Ryan talked to officials and students about what they think could behind, be behind rather the trend. Kansas State University President Richard Myers delivered his State of the University speech today here in the K-State Student Union the same day that it was announced that enrollment is down for the third year in a row. President Richard Myers touched on a variety of subjects during his State of the University address, but enrollment wasn't one of them. Does K-State have an enrollment problem? Well, we have enrollment's gone down for three, three semesters in a row, so that's not good. This comes after K-State has gone through multiple scandals, including an investigation into a rapist targeting students and white supremacist flyers posted on campus earlier this month. But Myers doesn't believe those events have affected enrollment. Our principals here are well articulated. People know them. Uh, for the most part, people live them. Why would you want to come here? Denisha Abercrombie is a senior at K-State. She believes scandals like these do affect enrollment. You add in a rapist, and I don't know about other people, but that's like probably one of my top fears. And so you add that to the racial slurs part, and that totally like goes against everything that we say we are. But there are other factors. K-State student body president Jack Ayers points out that more Kansas teens are simply deciding not to go to college. Obviously tuition uh, you know, is, is going to be a concern for students and cost is going to be a concern, but at the end of the day, uh, we need to be doing a better job of explaining uh, and selling that. K-State school newspaper says the 4% drop represents around 1,000 students. In Manhattan, James Ryan, KSNT News. And while K-State did see the biggest drop in enrollment in Kansas, they aren't alone. Pittsburgh and Emporia State saw more than 2% drop in enrollment also. Now, on the other hand, universities like Wichita State, Fort Hayes, and KU actually saw their numbers grow this year.